nice. Taking off, huh? <laughs> Don't go cutting loose just because I'm not there to keep an eye on you. I'll look after Futaba and the cat while you're gone. You owe me one. We'll talk more about our next job once you get back. Good. over six hours to get there, so why not sleep on the plane? I'll do that. Oh, it's almost time to check in. <sighs> Looks like it's gonna take off on time. I feel like a lot of flights headed to America tend to run late or get canceled. Is it just me, or is Ryuji not here yet? Ah. Oh. <sighs> I wasn't expecting to make a mad dash like this. Coming late even on a day like this? That's all you're bringing. Well, it's only four nights, right? Ain't it enough? Yeah, that! Well, I guess so. Hey, guys. They want us to gather near the boarding gate soon. Why don't we take a group shot before we take off? Oof, sounds good! You be our cameraman, okay? Let me join in too! You too, Makoto! <laughs> All right. Uh huh? Uh, where am I supposed to look? Let me see! Let me see! What? Holy shit, she's right. How could you tell, Futaba? Talk about a nasty trick! I am so glad she's not an enemy of ours. Is this the smell of Hawaii? Actually, I've been wondering since the airport, but uh, what is this smell? 
supposedly the lingering scent of carpet cleaner. It's coconut scented. Plus, I'd say the scent of plumeria for the lays are amplifying the tropical atmosphere here. <laughs> what are you, the king of random facts? <laughs> I'm the type that likes to look up stuff beforehand. Then, uh, tell me a cheap but good place to eat. Do that after we figured out room assignments. We can't go out until we get our keys. I want a room with this guy. You belong to a different class, Sakama Tokun. I can't? It complicates roll call. Everyone butts you out, after all. I bet there aren't many people who'd be okay rooming with you. Shut up! We both stick out like a sore thumb, you know. Takamaki-san, have you decided on which room to stay in? No, not yet. In that case, how about rooming with me? And if it's okay with you, do you want to walk around together once we're free to go about? We've never gone overseas before, so we thought it'd be reassuring if we had someone who knows English. Oh, sure, of course. Well, see you guys later. Oh, come on, can you just hurry up and make your decision? Oh, then is it okay if I room with you? It's decided, then. Anyway, don't do anything stupid, okay? This isn't Japan, you know. So this is Waikiki! Well, there sure are a ton of people here. And a lot of tall buildings like hotels. It's a little too clean here. Feels like an artificial resort. Still, look how clear the ocean is. The palm trees definitely give off a tropical vibe, too. I thought Anne was pretty impressive, but compared to the foreign ladies? Meh. Then stop looking! You think so too, don't you? Like, these ladies are massive unlike the girls in Japan. I know, right? Moving on, take a look over there. Isn't that Diamond Head? Oh, I saw it from the bus, too! But why is it called that? Are diamonds a local product? Wouldn't it say online? Ah, there we go. Wait, people long ago mistook Volcanic Rock for it? The F? Might as well look up recommended places in Waikiki, too! Oh, right! I wanted to eat pancakes! I wonder if there are any online recommendations of scenic spots. We should check for cheap and popular restaurants then. Hey, we're on our phones and chatting. This is no different from when we're in Japan. Even if we're overseas, we can see all the news in Japan if we got our phones. It's like, ugh, this ain't what I was expecting. We should do something that's more Hawaii-like. What's Hawaii-like? Uh, hula dancing? Uh-uh, I ain't down for that. We can finally take a breather. Oh, by the way, you know how the polls for the fan site ranking started, right? It's been really lively, huh? I'm the one who made the website, but even I'm surprised. I can't believe I'm part of such a huge thing. I'm so glad I've been rooting for the Phantom Thieves. On the contrary, did you hear about Akechi, that detective against the thieves? The good-looking one. His popularity plummeted after Medjet was dealt with. Supposedly, his official blog's up in flames. He posed as some hero of justice, but that's what he gets for not seeing eye to eye with them. <sighs> to be blunt, I can't focus on this trip. I keep thinking about the Phantom Thieves. Don't you think about them, too? You sure are calm. Something this amazing rarely happens, you know? But then again, I think I'm feeling a bit tired, too. Ah, <sighs> Let's go to bed. Good night. But Japanese people around here. I thought we were gonna be getting aloha's coming from all directions and stuff. 
It costs money to enjoy that atmosphere, you know? There's not much we can do as students. I guess it's the same no matter where we go. Hey, what's with the low energy, Makoto? I just had to listen to the taxi driver complain for 30 minutes straight. I'm used to dealing with students' troubles, but I never expected to have to do it overseas as well. That must have sucked. We should be doing some more exciting stuff. I mean, we're in freaking Hawaii, for God's sake. Isn't the school supposed to plan stuff? I want to go diving! It seems there wasn't enough time to come up with any kind of coordinated travel plan. That lack of coordination is what led to them using students as chaperones as well. By the way, you're rooming with Mishima, right? How is it? Anything interesting? Even in Hawaii? Fan site. You know, I do hear people talking about the Phantom Thieves every so often. Are they really mentioning us? I think so. We've already made our international debut. Man, just talking about that makes me want to go back to Japan so bad. You really have no chill. Come on, let's try and forget about those things for now. But people are waiting for us to fix society. We don't got time to be relaxing over here. Ain't that right, Yusuke? Wait, what the hell? Overseas travel provides a great opportunity for new insight. I'd prefer we stay here a bit longer. What are you doing here? Wasn't your school supposed to be going to Los Angeles? Apparently they couldn't land the plane due to a terrible storm brewing on the west coast. There were no signs of it letting up, so our destination was changed on the spot to Hawaii. Do you just bring rain wherever you go? Could it be that what happened at the fireworks festival was his fault as well? Don't go bringing any storms here, you got that? I'll do my best. By the way, there's nothing planned after this. What are you all gonna do? Uh, oh yeah, I, I still gotta buy souvenirs. My mom asked me to grab some stuff for her. I totally forgot about that. We need to pick things up for Futaba and Morgana too. I was hoping to do some shopping myself. Then it's settled. I wonder what Morgana would want. Man, our group's totally the same even out of Japan. Huh. I didn't realize Big Bang Burger was in Hawaii, too. Yeah, it's been getting real popular in Japan lately. I guess they wanted to branch out. Now that you mention it, I read a news article recently about the success of Okumura Foods. Ah, yes. The company that owns Big Bang Burger. Okumura? Ain't that the guy who's at the top of the fan site rankings? Is that true? I guarantee it. I don't make mistakes about that kind of stuff. Yeah, I didn't put the pieces together before, but I guess we know him pretty well. Hmm? Well, what's the matter? Oh, it's probably nothing. Just a rumor I heard about Okumura Foods. Supposedly, all of their overseas competition has mysteriously pulled out. Never mind, I'm surely just overthinking things. Sis's habits seem to be rubbing off on me. Hey, why don't we take a pic together? You know, so we can remember the trip and all. Ooh, good idea! Are you sure you don't want to be in it? <laughs> Thanks. I only ask that you ensure the composition is well balanced. Ugh, can you not worry about that stuff for one second? Go for it. Hmm, we still have some time to spare, right? Where to next? There's a convenience store down by the beach. How about there? That sounds lovely. I would quite like a short rest. All right, let's head over there. Hmm. Don't you think the food around here is kind of salty? You might be right. Oh, shoot. I forgot my sunscreen. I'm going to go buy another bottle at the convenience store. I'll go with you. I guess we will need to wait for them to come back. I'm so bored. By the way, 
You think we're the thieves everyone here has been going on about? It'd be pretty freaking crazy if that was true, huh? Huh. I had not heard of such rumors. It sounds wonderful. But we are already here, so why don't we confirm if that is the case? Oh, good idea! Let's try asking around while we wait for Ron and Makoto. Kind of cute. Maybe we should ask her some questions too. Uh, free time is almost up. Shouldn't you be heading back soon? Oh, yes. By the way, your blonde friends seem very excited on the airplane coming here. Hey, you're that girl we saw watering the plants. Sorry to surprise you. I'm another third year who was asked to come chaperone this trip. I accepted the task to take my mind off of things, but I wasn't sure how to spend my free time. We're here! I think I should be going. See you. Sorry, were you waiting long? Hmm. That girl you were talking to just now, do you know her? No, that was my first interaction with her. She said she was a third year. Same as you, Makoto. Mm-hmm. I've never really spoken to her, though. Ah, uh, it looks like our free time is over. Let's head back to the hotel. Oh, what am I doing? I feel like such an idiot for getting psyched for this. Then again, we are on a trip, so... Excuse me, Miss Kawakami? About the post-beach plans. Ah! Um, did I find you at a bedtime? Not at all! What's the matter? <sighs> found it. One after another, too. What did you find? Still working, can't tell you. <laughs> she can handle this without me. Ooh, so much! All I'm good for is driving them around in mementos. I'm basically useless. Kitty, your mumbling's distracting me! If you got something to say, just spit it out. It's nothing. What were you saying? Let me go! You feel so nice. I do not! So smooth and silky. It's kind of hard to believe fur this soft belongs to a human. Don't make me say it again. I'm a human! Couldn't you just be assuming that? I had the wrong assumptions about my mom for the longest time. That's not the same. I understand myself better than anyone. That's true. There are even more posts now. Oh, wow! The president of a company called Okumura Foods is rising very quickly up the rankings. Come on, you can't let this chance pass you by. It's rumored that Okumura Foods exploits their employees. Stuff like underpaying staff to reduce labor costs, that's how they have so many stores. What's up? Yo, why are you here? Just hear me out. The guy I'm rooming with went and brought his girlfriend back to the room. I felt totally awkward staying in there with him. I'm just gonna sleep here tonight. 
even though there are only two beds? Coming! Takanaki? <sighs> the girl I was sharing a room with took off to her boyfriend's room. I know that feeling. And she took the key. I stepped outside for just a second and the auto lock kicked in. I can't get back in my room. Huh? You're looking at stuff online even over here? Ever since the Medjet case, many people from overseas have been accessing the website. Isn't it crazy? The Phantom Thieves are finally making their worldwide debut. Oh, what should I do about overseas requests? Uh, I don't think we're the ones you should ask about that. They took down Medjet. I wonder who they'll bring justice to next. It's not just Japan anymore. The whole world's waiting to see the Phantom Thieves' next move. That reminds me, what time is it? <sighs> oh, so sleepy. I'm feeling pretty pooped. You think this could be that jet lag thing? It'll be too much hassle for me to go anywhere else. I'll just sleep in here tonight. Wait, what? I don't, I don't know if that's a good idea. Don't worry, I trust you guys. I saw that one coming. There are only two beds. Even if someone sleeps on the sofa. One of us is gonna have to sleep on the floor. So who's that gonna be? Oh, hey, playing cards. Why don't we use these to decide? Yes! What? I'm all the way in Hawaii, and I'm stuck sleeping on the floor. Hey, where'd Mishima go? He's in the bathroom. Ain't he been in there a while? The school trip. Shiho was really looking forward to this. On. Sorry, I didn't mean to bring the mood down. But it's already been almost six months since then, hasn't it? <laughs> this all feels so strange. Right? Hard to believe the rowdy kids at school are now famous all over the world. Don't you think we still have a lot to learn about each other, though? You know, things like what kind of people we like. So, time to come clean, Ryuji. Me? Uh, well, she's got to have a good personality. I'm okay with anyone who's modest and nice. What about if two girls with equally good personalities confess to you at the same time? If they're equally nice, uh, then it'd have to be the one with the hotter bod. So looks are what's most important to you. What? Your first answer was just superficial. The second answer was your true beliefs. Huh. So you really are that kind of guy. That ain't fair! What about you? Come on, spill the beans. What kind of girl is your type? Wait, are you talking about her? Well, we answered honestly. It's your turn next. So, what kind of guy do you... So, what kind of guy do you... My stomach. <sighs> that doesn't sound good. You know, wasn't he drinking the tap water earlier? That's like... The one thing you're not supposed to do when you're out of the country. No, I believe that is a wise decision. Though it was some third-rate tabloids article. Unnecessary information was leaked, after all. Besides, his investigation of the Phantom Thieves showed no progress since then. Yes. There's a possibility that he'll betray us out of spite since he was let go. Well, then. We'll make it so that it was a heart attack. As usual, he'll be left to deal with the... Oh? I wouldn't have thought of that. Well played, sir. It no longer matters if we deal with one or two of those connected to us. Ah, 
Our trip is almost over. But tomorrow night, we'll be in the airplane heading home. Damn it! This isn't how stuff was supposed to go. What do you mean? We ended up walking around, same as we always do in Japan. I mean, we even ate out of freaking Big Bang Burger. It's like we never left! Wine all you'd like, but that's what the trip was supposed to be. But weren't some other guys getting all cozy with their girlfriends or some shit? I think... And that's it! That's what this trip is missing! Come on, we totally gotta get moving during our free time in the afternoon. What are we going to do? Make a once-in-a-lifetime summer memory! Hawaii's famous for its beaches, and, you know, what happens in Hawaii stays in Hawaii. We can get some girls' numbers during the day, then sneak away to them at night. <laughs> you in or what? Me too? It'll be great! Neither of us have girlfriends who'd get mad about it either. I guess it's true, but... Come on, I know you're acting all cool, but you're totally coming with. No question about it. Ooh, you get a message? Who could that... Uh, actually, you don't gotta answer that. It might be something about you-know-what. Come on, Mishima, let's go. Wait, what just happened? It's only going to be the two of us, Sakamoto? Don't give me that look. We're going to Waikiki. Try and get a little more excited. And... Sorry to ask you out here so suddenly. Being a chaperone is more difficult than I expected. We've had a lot of meetings. I honestly wanted to contact you earlier, but this is the first free moment I've had. <laughs> Thank you. All right then, let's take a walk. Oh, a food stand. Garlic shrimp. I've heard that's a famous Hawaiian dish. Are you adventurous when it comes to food? That's amazing. I always just stick with the standard fare. Well, let's give it a try. You two from Japan? Uh, yes, we are. How about them phantom thieves, huh? The guys that steal hearts. <laughs> How do you know about them? Heard about it on the news. They're all the rage in Japan, yeah? Seems like we're even making headlines abroad. Say, if you run into them, tell them I say hello. And ask them to change people's hearts so everyone loves shrimp. <laughs> uh, uh, of course. I'll do just that. Amazing. How beautiful. Oh, it's already so late. My sister would be upset if she saw me laid back like this. To tell you the truth, I wasn't particularly eager to go on this trip. But if it's like this... I think I'd like to come again. Yeah. Um... I'd like you to have this. It's not the best souvenir, but... It will remind you of the memories we made today. Thank goodness. Well, we should probably return before it gets dark. 
I suppose I can't complain about that. <sighs> it was terrible getting dragged around by Sakamoto all day. Do you think I'll have to go through this on future school events as well? Yikes. <sighs> I don't know. It's fun hanging out with Sakamoto, but he might be too different from me. Is getting a girlfriend my only way out of this situation? Well... Anyway, we need to wake up early tomorrow. Let's get some sleep, okay? Hey. trip is finally coming to a close. I never thought I would have the chance to go on one this year as well. Barely even felt like I was out of the country, though. Even Yusuke showed up. I'm simply glad the storm didn't make its way over here. It may not have been the most exciting trip, but we still had a good time. Honestly, though, I'm thankful we didn't have to deal with the storm. They truly are dreadful. So, what did you end up doing yesterday? Keeping secrets from me? That's against the bro code! What, by yourself? No way I'm gonna believe that. The desperation in your face is quite unbecoming, Ryuji. That's enough, you guys. It felt like this trip went by in a flash. I'm not sure if I want to go home or stay here longer at this point. 
Hey, why don't we shop for souvenirs together before it's time to go? Ooh, count me in. Allow me to join you as well. Although I have no funds for souvenirs. You're going to be able to get back to Japan, right? What do you think Morgana and Futaba would like? The traditional souvenir from Hawaii is usually chocolate. Oh, but Morgana can't eat chocolate. Well, he tells us that he's not a cat, so maybe it's fine? If we're gonna get him souvenirs, we gotta pick stuff they'll really wig out over. Why don't we split up and look around then? Look, they have coffee with butter in it. Do you think it tastes good? There's acai powder over here. Doesn't it feel like you could just spend forever at places like these? I know what you mean. We've come all the way to Hawaii. I think it'd be best for our gifts to focus on impact rather than taste. Oh, well said. In that case, let's find something we wouldn't buy ourselves, but we'd be happy to get as a gift. I'm not seeing anything. I mean, this is Futaba and Morgana we're talking about. Their standards for happiness are way too high. Yusuke, you find something? An hourglass that measures three minute increments. Uh, w why? Well, Futaba loves instant yakisoba. It brilliantly meets the requirements of an item I wouldn't buy for myself, but would please me to receive. But can't she just buy one of those in Japan? Oh crap, we're almost out of time! Okay, Yusuke and I will find Futaba's souvenir and we'll leave Morgana's to you. Hello? Senpai! Uh, oh, so I didn't scare you, huh? Huh? Who's that? Find anything suitable? Hmm? That girl? Ah, sorry to be a bother. I'm Yoshizawa, a first year. It's nice meeting you all. Oh, you're that gymnast! Yes, that's right. Our club is here at a training camp to get ready for the next big meet, and I just happened to find him. The last meet was only a short while ago, though. You're already training for the next one? You seem to be making quite the effort. Well, I absolutely have to get the results I'm looking for at the next competition. The team's been training with a famous coach who lives here on the island. She's working us especially hard. We end up in tears almost every day. Your dedication to training even when overseas is admirable. We should all learn from your example. Yep. Good luck at the next meet. We're all rooting for you. Thank you. Your kind words may be what keeps me from crying today. Hey, uh, it's fine if you do cry, though. You know what they say, what doesn't thrill you makes you stronger. Ah, I almost forgot we're out of time here. Uh, well, I'm gonna go pay for my stuff. Ooh, I ought to do that too. See you later, Yoshizawa-san. Yes, it was nice meeting you all. Your friends seem like a fun bunch. Mm-hmm, I think so too. Well, I know I'm going to win for sure this time. I'll prove to everyone what I'm made of. Considering the rank I got last time, though, I also got this souvenir as a sort of insurance. I bought it earlier today at this branch of a Japanese shrine here in Hawaii. I always used to buy some kind of charm before a big competition. My sister was even more stringent with her own superstitions. The thing is, I forgot to pick one up before the last meet. I'll be fine now, though. I just know it. I should probably get going. I almost forgot that I still need to pick up souvenirs for my family. Sorry for keeping you so long. I'll see you later, all right?
why there was no need for you to have angered our director right now. But still, you would have eventually shut up if you just not have I guess you got a point. <laughs> Yo, welcome back. You get tanned a bit? How is Hawaii? <gasps> He's been Hawaiianized. Uh, I can understand why. While you guys were off having fun, things here have gotten a bit more complicated. So I've heard the surprisingly hot items at the moment are masks and calling cards. Here's a graph of the profits for stores handling these items. Double from last year? Phantom Thief goods seem to be in especially high demand. I didn't know they sold that kind of stuff. Should we try to? I mean, selling Phantom Thief merchandise? I don't think we need to worry about that. They'll get caught the second they try to sue. Not like I'd actually want to sell their stuff, though. I wonder how our guests consider this recent phenomenon. What do you think, Akechi Kun? Well. There he is, the anti thief detective. I hope he slips up and self destructs. <laughs> I can sense some chivalry behind their actions. They are clever to take the silent resentments of the public into account and relieve them. I believe that may be the secret to their popularity. Well, this is surprising. Your stance seems to have softened. This doesn't change the fact that they are dangerous. However, no, I shouldn't say anymore. Come on, you can say it. Oh no, I won't be falling for that. I've learned my lesson after the previous backfire. These thieves are more popular than the police or politicians. What's the world coming to? Rude! What are you so angry about? Hey, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Take care of any customers that show up. I finished the analysis. You know, of the data. Wanna meet now? Seriously? Jet lag? Fine then. Tomorrow.
Let's do it. <laughs>